McDonald's launches its latest and questionable celebrity collaboration, and Ocean Spray reacts to a dream TikTok moment. I'm Jeff Beer, and this is Fast Company's brand hit and miss of the week. For this week's miss, we're back at the Golden Arches. Now, this may actually sound like a hit at first because the brand has collected millions of eyeballs and new customer orders thanks to a collaboration launched last month with Travis Scott. And it was much more than just a quarter pounder with cheese and bacon, fries with barbecue sauce, and a Sprite. It also included a limited merch collection of t-shirts, hoodies, and more. But now, just a month later, and a day after the Scott promo ended, the company announced a new signature combo with reggaeton star J Balvin. Nothing against J Balvin, but for a brand that hasn't had a signature combo since Michael Jordan in 1992, two in two months? seems a bit much. Not only that, but part of the appeal here is the novelty of an artist or celebrity teaming with a household food brand. If McDonald's is trying to boost its numbers with a streetwear-like strategy, it also needs to recognize that part of that power resides in limitation and exclusivity. The celebrity food trend appears to be a thing. Charlie D'Amelio has the Charlie with Duncan, and Chipotle has a David Dobrik burrito, named for the popular YouTuber. Look, let's face it, these are fun ways to drive new business, and for customers, it's cheaper than a pair of sneakers. Still, there has to be a limit to their appeal, and most likely that limit will be hit through unchecked frequency and ubiquity. Much like the air in any town with a McDonald's, you can smell this thirsty marketing pitch a mile away. The hit this week goes to Ocean Spray. The brand had a quick and fun reaction this week to the work of TikToker 420 Dogface 208, also known as Nathan Adapaka. Adapaka, a 37-year-old father of two in Idaho, went viral for his laid-back longboarding while lip-syncing Fleetwood Mac's Dreams and drinking Ocean Spray Cranberry Juice. His post so far has more than 20 million views and gave the 1977 hit Dreams its biggest streaming week ever. Ocean Spray got in on the action by gifting Adapaka a brand new pickup truck. He had told the LA Times he was originally longboarding because he needed to get his car fixed, and they stocked it full of juice. Of course this is a blatant move by the brand to draft off the feel-good vibes Adopeka put out into the world and people responded to. Even CEO Tom Hayes joined TikTok for a response video, a distinct departure from the brand's usual ads of farmers knee-deep in cranberries. But the best part here is that the brand doesn't appear to be overdoing it, just rewarding some good old-fashioned creativity. Anselmo Ramos, chief creative officer at indie agency Gut, which doesn't represent Ocean Spray, tweeted his appreciation saying, no ad agency would ever present an Ocean Space script like this. A viral TikTok is a beautiful organic content miracle. If this ever happens to your brand, be extremely thankful. Don't overthink, jump on it right away and play along. The other brands should just watch in awe. It also feels distinctly fresh in the sense that there is now an entire influencer economy around people doing things on social media for the express purpose of making money off brands. Here, we just have a guy in Idaho who made something fun on his way to work, and the brand managed to roll with it instead of ruin it. That's it for this week. Thanks for watching.